what's up you guys welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for coming back for another motivational video with me today so today on the agenda i just have a few things that i will be getting done around the house starting right here in the kitchen i'm just getting the dishes loaded in the dishwasher and then i'll be hand washing the dishes that i have left over so if you are new to my channel please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe sit back relax and enjoy the motivation y'all
All right, guys, so I made my way into the laundry room. I'm going to get my daughter's uh, shoes washed. This will be the shoes that she will be wearing to school. So I'm going to get them all unstrung and throw them into the washing machine. Got me in a trance of just one plant, so don't wait no more. Oh, I'm me, I'm more. Oh, I'm the one you're looking for, sure. Oh, girl, I see you over there hesitating, deliberating. You keep me waiting on a sign, looking at the corner of your eyes. So I pick my feet up off the floor, move my hips closer to yours, catch my breath, and I say, I'm the one you're looking All right, guys, moving on into the girl's bathroom. I'm just going to get the toilet all sprayed down, give that a quick clean, get the tub all sprayed down because I'm going to clean that, vacuum in here, and then after all of that, I will be using a trick that I learned from another YouTuber. So what she did was she used a disinfectant wipe to essentially mop the floor or clean the floor. So I didn't want to bring out my whole mop just for their bathroom. So I used her trick and I think it worked really great. I was able to get up a lot of dirt and everything. I'll be showing you guys that once that's done. But yeah, so I wanted to share that with you guys just so you know, it'll be another trick that you can use just in case you don't feel like pulling out your whole mop just for a small space. Is this all that you dreamed it be? Ending up here. So for my girls tub today, I decided to use the baking soda creme cleanser. I usually use this on my sink and my sink only, but I wanted to try it today in the tub just to see how it works. And it, it worked pretty good. I think I would keep using it for my sink mostly, but um, it did work pretty good on the tub.
what's up you guys i just wanted to give you guys a quick um haul i me and my husband went to kohl's walmart and just picked up a few things from uh target well not clothes from target but picked up a few things for the girls for school uh tomorrow so just wanted to show you guys those little things really fast um my three-year-old will be going to preschool and at her preschool they will be wearing uh uniforms so her uniforms haven't came in yet so um she has to wear like solid color tops and then she can wear like leggings or shorts or whatever she want on the bottom but um we just picked up these little leggings little gray leggings from walmart they were three dollars 98 cents and she, so she has to have red i'm sorry white black and red like these are her school colors and they have to be like solid color shirts until her uniform tops come in so we just picked up these three from walmart they were all three dollars and 98 cents each and yeah so we didn't really get much for her because she's gonna be wearing uniforms anyway um just picked up some more school supplies from target y'all <laughs> these 24 pack of crayons are so hard to find like i know we kind of did our shopping in like the last minute or whatever but <laughs> save some crayons for the rest of us okay they done took all the crayons we lucky my eight-year-old found this box just like laying around so got these for her from target we had to end up getting the i guess it's a, it's another brand not crayola but i mean it works too so she had to have three packs for uh her so at kohl's kohl's was having a little uh a little bit of a sale uh we just got her a pack of socks and we picked up her this cute little Minnie Mouse shirt. She picked that out. She really liked that. Um, got some more leggings for my uh, three-year-old. And then these these leggings were, I think they were, it says $10 on the tag, but I'm pretty sure they were on uh, sale at Kohl's. Um, picked up this shirt for my eight year old is so cute y'all it's so cute and then she picked out this shirt right here she mainly just needed some more shirts because she has a lot of bottoms and i'll show you guys in a second and then she picked out this shirt look a little huge but it's her it's her size um she picked out this one as well these this shirt and the Minnie Mouse shirt, they were two for 20, I believe, at Kohl's. And then these two Harley, Hurley shirts were 15 each. And this one comes with like the little cute little headband thing you can put across your, on your head or on your wrist or whatever. But I thought they were so cute, but yeah, that's pretty much it. We didn't really get a lot because they still got a good bit of summer clothes and it's still gonna be a little warmer here for a little bit longer in Oklahoma. So um, let me show you guys their drawers. Like I said, my eight year old has a lot of bottoms. So she don't really need bottoms like that. She mostly needs tops because she don't have that much. So. Yeah, and then this is my youngest starter drawer. So their laundry, watch out, baby. Their laundry needs to be done anyway. But let me show you guys their or my eight-year-old's book bag and all the supplies. These are all of her supplies just sitting on the table. And then this is her cute little book bag that she picked out. It's from Target. I think it's so cute, Mommy. but yes, baby, hold on, okay? Mommy. So I have to um, label all of this stuff with her name Mommy. on it. So I'm Mommy. going to, 
I'm going to get the tags off of the new clothes that I just bought <clears throat> for them. Get the tags off of those. Get those thrown in the washing machine. Get their shoes moved around uh, to the dryer. And then I'm going to get her um, school supplies labeled. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and get my daughter's all of her school supplies labeled. So for her school, they have to bring their own water bottle and headphones to school. So we're going to get everything labeled and put away in her backpack.
I wanted to show you guys this because I know y'all see me try to put these shoes in the dryer, but it does not work in my dryer. Um, I don't know, it times out really fast. I guess it senses like the weight or whatever, and it times out really fast. So I'm just gonna let them air dry, and then I'm gonna get up early in the morning and lace them up. But she'll probably, she'll probably wear these in the morning because I think the washing machine, it did really, really good uh, cleaning these because these shoes were still in great condition. She didn't use them a lot during the summer. So save us some money and kids are rough anyway. I know they're going to be at a uh, recess and everything. So we didn't want to waste money on getting her new shoes when she has perfectly good shoes right here. So I'm just going to let these air dry. Uh, and I'll get up early in the morning before they do and either lace them up or just pick her out of outfit to go with these but yeah i just wanted to you know kind of let y'all know about that i don't know maybe y'all can tell me if what kind of setting um works for shoes or whatever on the dryer i don't know i put it on the heavy duty one right there but it did not work so <laughs> Um, sorry y'all, that's the washing machine going. But yeah, so I have their clothes in the washing machine as you guys see me put in there. And then I'm going to, once those are done, transfer those to the dryer. And then I will pick out their outfit for in the morning, first day of school. I'll let you guys see uh, that. And then we'll wrap up the video.